my favorite people, my downline. I just want to let you know that I sent out your packets for the July 10th meeting at 2 p.m. But I wanted to explain the things. I have three projects in there and Helene is doing another one, making up for the month that we're skipping. So I wanted to show you what I meant by certain things. So you will get a list of, like that looks like this, in there and I need you to cut your um, backs of your cards. So the, you need to cut one card base, 11 by four and a quarter, and it can be out of that soft succulent or white cardstock and score at five and a half inches. Then I need you to cut another card base out of white cardstock again, 11 by four and a quarter, scored at five and a half inches. Then on a scrap of white, you're gonna get with the three rectangles that I think it's picture this, that cut out in the middle rectangle, um, just put some words in there. They can be in green or black um, that match the paper. And um, there's some extra squares in there. Do not throw anything away in your packet. You're gonna be using everything there. So it might look like, oh, that's the scrap that we took out of there, but you need that. So please don't toss it. Okay, then the next thing is um, cut a piece of cardstock four by five and a quarter out of a color that looked like a wall. Um, so, and then you're going to emboss it portrait style. So you can use the brick wall, stucco, wood grain, or just any kind of random pattern to make a wall. But portrait means up and down, uh, like a portrait would be. And then in this case, I did a brick wall on mine, a gray brick wall, but you could do red or anything. Okay, or anything else. Um, so that's that. Then you're going to... Uh, you've got a piece of cardstock that looks like this and you need to do something with that. So you can use any, you can just use plain old blue paper, you can sponge it, you can put clouds on it or whatever. But what I mean by that is you're going to cut down a piece of, of paper to match the size of this. And then if you want to, you can put some grass or whatever because you're going to get the window dies and this has to fit in the window. And you might want to do a little scene, put a little tree on there or a house on there or some people or whatever so that when you get done, it's the size of this, okay? So you might want to cut a little curvy hill like that and put it on some, some paper and then make sure it fits on your card, okay? So in this case, I would cut it out, obviously, and make it fit to the card size, so that would be it. But I wanted to explain that in case it was as clear as mud. That that's what you need to do. Okay, and everybody's gonna look different and everybody's gonna make a different scene in the window, but it should fit on here so that it works in the project. All right, so that's another thing. That's number uh, five. And then I gave you one piece of white cardstock with these birches cut out on them. And um, it seems like people are confused with the challenge for this month, so I'll explain that at the next meeting. But so I gave you one of these cut out of white cardstock and your job is to make a card with it that we can do for show and tell at the meeting. You can do whatever you want to, to it. All it is is birch, uh, birch branches and then you can put whatever you want in the back and then embellish it any way you want to. I do have the whole bundle, but you don't need to use this. You can use whatever you have in your stash or you want to cut out. So that pretty much explains what's happening at the um, meeting. And I just wanted to show you, see, this is actually gonna fit in here. So you want a little scene in there so when we get done do what we're doing, everything's done. So I could put maybe put a tree here, I could put a deer on the hill or whatever. But so that whatever you see in the, the window is what you're going to see. So make a little scene to go in here and then um, emboss. Uh, portrait style, it could be red, gray, black, whatever color you want. You're gonna have a white background on it, so you probably don't wanna do it on white. And then make sure that you make a card with what I cut out you for this. So you'll actually be doing uh, a card with this, a card with the three rectangle windows, and then everybody's gonna share what they did with this. So see you soon, bye.